Welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy V. This is 480 Volts. Between last episode and this episode, I ran from 15 more battles. That gets me up to 255 battles that I've run from in total. So that's it. We're done running from battles. That's all I need. Uh, and it will be a long time before the thing that I needed to run from 15 battles for will come into play. But for now, let's just get in our submarine. And let's dive underwater. And let's go to this little area right here. As you can see, I've restored everybody. We're gonna go up into Guido's cave. And we're gonna fight some monsters. Radiator. These guys are, well, they have pretty high defense, but when Ferris pulls off the sword dance, they're real nice. Oh yeah, and I guess uh, Lena's wearing a wall ring. Oh, hey, hey. oh, that was bad. Actually, no, that was good. That was good. That would have been bad if it had hit anybody else besides Ferris, but because she's wearing bone mail, it had the opposite effect on her. It fed her HP while draining it from the enemy. Let's see. Yeah. Because technically Ferris is undead. And... Stupid thing did it again. <laughs> I'm okay with that. I, I don't think Lena needs to be wearing a wall ring. It's not really gonna... Yeah, give her an elf cape. In case I need to heal her up, it would be bad if I went to heal her up. And... It just... It bounced off of her. I might consider giving that to... Uh... Oh, that hurt. I said I might consider giving the uh, wall ring to Ferris. Something to consider. Okay, for now, let's heal up Gallop. We'll have Gallop charm the pants off of these guys with his lovely voice. I, I barely worked on the Summoner John class at all. And I'm not sure if Vampire, if that's like a blue magic spell or what. I guess I'll find out after this battle. I don't think it is, but it's it's not like normal Drain. I mean, it acts like Drain, but it's pretty nasty. It's worse than Drain. Uh, whatever. Yeah, you keep using mucus on yourself. Hey, he's still alive. Dead? Yes, dead. Okay, it's not a blue magic spell. I thought it might be. I'm wondering... Mmm, lowers the defense quite a bit. I don't know if I want to do that. Well, not now anyway. There will be time, so I might want to do that later on. Put the reflect ring on uh, Ferris. Oh, but what do we got here? Oh no, wrong way. Go down here. Well, we've got... Uh, doesn't look like there's any way to get out of here. There's a chest. Let's see what's in the chest. It's an empty box. Huh? There's a big rock inside. Lift it? Yeah. Ugh, it sure is heavy. Alright, we got a bit of a puzzle now. Removing that rock from the chest closed that door up top. So, if we put it back, it opens the door. Now, I don't want to do that. I want to put it back in one of the other chests. I think I want to do this chest. Yeah, that's right. And I'll get into a battle, sure. More radiators. Phantom Force 5 style. <laughs> and, ow. That hurt. Okay, that's what I get for making a corny joke. And Charm Song. But yeah, and I guess Charm Song's not 100% efficient on everything. It, I thought it was like, any enemies that can be charmed, it'll charm them. It doesn't work on every enemy that can be charmed. You've seen that. I've had two enemies that can be charmed, and Charm Song only worked on one of them. So it's it's about as random or as efficient as just a normal magic spell. Maybe a little more efficient, but it's not 100% efficiency. Still works pretty good, though. Alright, that works for me. You can do mucus. That tempting tank was already charmed. Alright, let's take out that one over there. 
Eh, charm him again. I kind of fear the vampire move. It's kind of deadly. And holy crap, everybody's got 700 HP except for Gallop. Not Gallop, Lena. Hey, if that doesn't kill him, which it probably won't. There we go. I'm good now. We're good now. Just finish them off. Thank you. The AVP's good, but yeah. Anyway, let's go up in here. Ah, uh, yes. Hit a switch here, and it opens up a secret somewhere else. Not sure where that is, but okay. Now, I don't think I want to put the the rock in the chest to my right. I don't think that does any good, but I will put it down here. That opens up this door. Hope I'm going the right way. Uh, radiators again. There's another enemy you can run into here, but I'm not wanting to. Eh, uh, you yeah, whatever. Charm them, I guess. Yeah, see, it didn't charm that one guy. But now he's charmed. Because I'm pretty sure Tempting Tango always works on the guys that can be charmed. Yeah, just kill him. Oh, that hurt. That wasn't nice. Is that gonna kill him? No. This'll kill him. No, it won't. Because he used Vampire, that's why. There we go. Wait for this guy to do his thing. Yeah, that works. And... That works. Okay. <laughs> and Bart's gained a level, Lena gained a level, Ferris gained a level... That's all. Not Gallop. He's still at level 25. Let's plop up here. Alright, this is the area that I just opened up earlier with the secret switch down below. So, I hope I'm going the right way. And there's a new enemy, Metamorpha. If you don't kill him quickly enough, he morphs into some other type of enemy. But he, I didn't want to do terrain magic. Uh, whatever. Actually, that worked. Now he's confused. I forgot, Terrain Magic does do that. Uh, I don't think he's undead. Okay, he's not. Okay, he just hurt himself. I'll tempt him again. And, yeah. And he's gotta be close to dying. Well, I'll just charm him anyway. Maybe we can... Okay, I was gonna say, maybe we can get Sword Dance, but maybe not. Yeah, he casts Old, and he casts Shell, and he does all that stuff. He casts Ice 3. Sometimes it's better to just confuse them and let them die. Like, you know, let them just kill themselves. He's got a lot of HP. Yeah, now he's dead. <laughs> but look at that AVP he gives off. That's pretty good. He gives off crappy experience, but... Let's give, uh... I don't know why she doesn't have white magic on, but we, she needs that. And Elf Cape. That's good enough. A actually, you know what? Let's give Galif for Let's give the the gold hairpin to Lena. And the coronet to Galif. Because I feel that Lena's going to be making use of magic more than Galif. So she needs the extra... Uh, efficiency as far as MP. I so hope I'm going the right way. It doesn't matter if, if... I'm gonna have to come back to this area anyway, so it really doesn't matter. Uh, that was good damage there, Ferris. Let's see if we can't uh, charm him. There we go. Old... That move was old, and he just did a... Whatever. You know what? Well, whatever.
I'm just, you know what, let's just go ahead and do the speed song. I think it'd just be better. That way we can just keep killing this guy as quickly as possible. Because eventually he will trans... Yeah, there he goes. Change! He changed into a Galacat. Like, that's intimidating. He can change into other stuff, too, so watch out for that. And I killed him. Galak in a job level and he earned blue. Is that... No, he did not master the blue mage job class. But, to be honest, that's really the most crucial of the blue mage. So I think for right now... I'm just... I'm think, I think for right now we'll have him gain some abilities as a summoner. With... Sing. No, I said with Sing. There we go. Uh, I don't care about that. There we go. Uh, now let's go down these set of stairs and see what awaits us. A battle. Jitterbug duet. Nice. I, I, I really would like you... Oh wow, Ferris' HP is up in the 800s. That's pretty good. Ah, uh, speed, that works. Although it'd be nice if Ferris would use, uh... Sword Dance, and he just changed into that thing. World Demon. Uh, I don't care about the World Demon. That's an easy enemy if I ever seen one. The, the worst thing they can do is... Oh my gosh, you gotta be freaking kidding me. No! No! That is so not fair! Arrow 3, he could have learned that. It's a blue magic spell, he could have learned it, but I didn't have him set up the right way. Ugh! He just cast it on Gallop. That is so not fair. That's alright, I'll have another opportunity to learn Arrow 3 pretty quickly, too. So, I'm not too concerned about that. But I think on this next turn, we'll have him charm just to avoid that. Okay, whatever. Yes! Sing the charm song again. There you go, sword dance. That's how you're supposed to do it. I cannot believe he used arrow three on Gallop when Gallop was not a blue mage. <sighs> That's alright, I'll, I'll learn arrow three later. Sometime. Eh, charm. That works. I'm just gonna be on fast forward until he does something to himself. Like, there you go. Eh. Eh, whatever, just kill the thing. Oh, he's gonna change anyway. He's gonna change into that. Oh, he's gonna change into Ifrit. That's not fair. Wow, you can charm Ifrit. Who would have thunk it? I wonder what would happen if I used Ifrit. Well, we'll never know now because I just killed him. I didn't know these guys could do that, and I just got a flame scroll. That's pretty awesome. <laughs> wow. I never let those guys do their thing. All right, uh, you're supposed to go this way. Yeah, I, I definitely went... I can't, I'm kind of going the wrong way. I'm going the right way, but I kind of went the right way too soon. It's okay, because I'm going to have to backtrack anyway. Just trust me when I say that I do. And now these guys are starting to get annoying. <sighs> oh. Yeah, you do your old thing. What are you gonna change into now? You're gonna change into Rama. And I just charmed Rama. I didn't know this guy could do that. That's really weird. Oh, that hurt. Ow. Oops. It's okay because... Well, it's not really okay, but... It will be okay when I make it okay. 
or now we'll charm him. Or not. He's gonna change back into crew dust. Oh boy. Good, we killed him quickly. And Lena's got dimension level six. Awesome. So now I'll switch her back into a white mage. And give her dimension magic. Yay! With the gold hairpin. Now let's go this way. And a turtle. Jump on to the pond? Yes, let's jump into the pond. And we swim across the pond. Uh, I'm not controlling. Okay, now I'm controlling. Okay. There's nothing on either side, so let's just go straight up. And there's a turtle! What's this turtle? It's a turtle. What's it look like? And he's pounding it. That's turtle abuse, Barts. Barts! Stop it! And Gallif likes turtles, I guess. And Barts is like, this is fun! But this is fun! Well, I didn't realize he actually said that. Cut that out! Okay, I gotta find a better voice for him. It, it spoke? Sage Guido, I am so sorry for his impoliteness. Wait, what? Guido? No. Hey, wait, you mean this turtle is Sage Guido? Yes, she is. How could you be so rude? Oh, whoops. Sorry, dude. <laughs> It's fine, it's fine. Sorry. It's fine. Anyways, I have something to tell you. You must hurry. Is it about x -Death? Yes. Yeah, that's an annoying voice. Yes, the thing he is after is in the Great Forest of Moi. The Great Forest of Moi? The living forest which stretches to the west of Surrogate Castle, x -Death's birthplace. Alright, so he was born in a forest. About 500 years ago, an evil spirit sealed in the Moi forest turned one of the trees into a monster. This tree is X-Death. For 500 years, I had kept X-Death sealed, but 30 years ago, the seal was broken. Wait. X-Death is a freaking tree? What? What? Oh, gosh. This story just... It's good in its simplicity, but every once in a while it just fails. That's gotta be the dumbest idea for a villain I've ever heard. The Battle of the Four Warriors of Dawn 30 years ago. Yes, Dorgan and his fellows did very well. They, re they resealed X-Death with the power of the crystals. But now he has returned. It's our fault. No, it's not. Anything sealed is destined to return. He must be destroyed this time. Yeah, Barnes, it's not your fault, it's Sid's fault. Get it right. Well, where would he be? Probably in the Great Forest of Moi. He seeks something that lies there. The Great Forest of Moi. Please, go to the Great Forest and protect what rests there. As for me, well, I'm a turtle. To the Great Forest of Moi. For Zizz's vengeance. And to defeat Extep. Let's go. They all had to say it. The forest of Moi is alive. No matter who they might be, anyone who enters the forest will be attacked. Take this with you. And he gives us... The Elder Branch. He gave us a tree branch. Hey, maybe we can whack X-Death on the head with it. I'd say give him splinters, but if he's a tree, that wouldn't really help. What's this? It's a branch of the oldest tree in the forest, a part of the protector of the seal. With this, you can enter the forest. So if x supposedly is 500 years old, at least, that means this tree is older than that. Please hurry, x is already on his way to the forest of Moi. Gotcha! And you say anything else? Yeah. Alright, let's get out of here. Well, I could use the exit spell, but I'll actually walk back and I'll jump. I'll walk back and gain some experience and go to the area that I for, I missed. There's an area that I missed. Ugh. Just yeah, this is pretty 
boring and self-explanatory. Although I need to heal everybody up. <sighs> For once, Ferris, use Jitterbug Duet. Or use Tempting Tango. Uh, heal the healer. Always. Always heal the healer. I don't care about that. There you go, Sword Dance. And he's still alive. That's how tough this guy is. I guess Sword Dance didn't break him from his confusion. That's interesting. Whatever. Yeah, let's just get out of here. I'm sick of these guys. <sighs> I might start using more magic. I don't know. I don't know. I think can use Flash, if, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, it sure can, and it just... Who'd it get? Well, it got Bards, which sucks, because he has the aim command. But... Oh, and it also got Gallop. That's good to know. But I'm going to undo that on Bards. And I'll just charm this guy. Can you do something else? Thank you. There we go. Uh, wrong way. There we go. Ah. There you go, Jitterbug Duet. I should uncharm or unblind. I should give Gallop his sight back. Come on, dude. There you go, Sword Dance. And he's still freaking alive. There we go. And he just changed. I gotta be quick. There we go. I didn't get anything from that battle. That sucks. That's lame. Alright, let's get out of here. Now, here's what we're going to do. We're going to take the rock out of this chest. And we're going to put it over here. And go in here. This might lead to a dead end, actually. Yeah, it does, so never mind. So I thought there was something else here, but I guess not. What you going to change into? Oh, Shiva! That didn't kill her. I might just go ahead and use Ifrit on her. Yeah, let's use Ifrit. That didn't do very good damage at all. Ow. That hurt a little bit. I want to use Cure 2 because uh, on everybody because of Ferris' bone nail. So. Okay, that works. Those enemies are just weird to me. They give off good AB ABP, so... So I can't really complain too much. They take forever to kill, though. There you go, Sword Dance. There we go. Oh, will you die already? Fine, just just be that way. There we go. All I want to do... Put the rock in the center of the chest. Now we can get out of here. You guys again! I'm about sick of you. In fact, I am sick of you. Die. In fact, you know what? Let's just go ahead and use a uh, comet. I didn't do Jack. What you gonna change into now? Oh, you, Elf Toad. I don't care about you. 
There we go. I need to get out of this place. This place is annoying. Okay, got back into my yellow submarine. Catch a few Z's. And let's pilot back to land. And I will save. And in the next video, we'll go to the Forbidden Forest of Moir, or whatever the place is called. And we'll see if we can't stop x for good. Until then, this is 480, signing off.